Hey y'all, welcome back to our NCLEX question of the day. My name is Nkoli, a nurse here at UWorld, and this week's topic is ECG, so lots of rhythm checks. So let's get started. The nurse is caring for a hemodynamically stable client who's experiencing the cardiac rhythm in the ECG strip shown below. Which of the following actions should the nurse take? Take a moment to pause the video, drop your answers down in the comments, and let me know what you guys think. So let's first identify the rhythm. I don't see any P waves, and what I do see that look like QRS waves look fast and abnormal, so I know it's going to be a ventricular rhythm. In this case, it's VTAC. But going back to the question, this client is still hemodynamically stable, meaning that they're usually still awake and talking to you. So we want to go from least invasive to most invasive. So the correct answer would be option one, administer amiodarone. This is an antiarrhythmic medication to try to reset that heart back to normal sinus rhythm. Option two is incorrect because we only defib V-fib or pulse this VTAX. And since they're hemodynamically stable, we don't need to defib them at this moment. Option three is wrong because although the client is stable, the rhythm definitely still needs to be treated for what is causing this rhythm. And then option four is incorrect because digoxin can actually cause this with digoxin toxicity. So again, the correct answer for this one is option one. Check the link in our bio for more information.